DigitalKnowledgeBox.com Okay, the next screws to be removed are, once again with the Phillips head, you'll see them in here, one, two, three, okay? Very small little Phillips head screws that, um, that you need to take out right there. They were hidden behind that L bracket that we initially removed. All right, so I'm back on track here. Actually, I had to go get a, uh, a smaller Phillips head screwdriver. So this was a number zero if you're at the store, uh, pick this up. But the next step is to remove these two uh, screws in there. So these are the ones that are located uh, to the far left and right of this bracket here in the battery area. So we're gonna go ahead and remove those. Again, the organization of these screws is very important, so make sure you have some way to remember which screws go into which location. For a complete list of all the tools and a link to where you can actually pick up a replacement DVD drive for your MacBook, please visit digitalknowledgebox.com forward slash Mac DVD replace. There you'll be able to find the complete video download as well as a, a helpful ebook, 50 easy steps to replacing the MacBook optical drive. So again, that's digitalknowledgebox.com forward slash Mac DVD replace. DigitalKnowledgeBox.com. Digital